guys I like to show you how to make glutinous rice balls in ginger syrup or jia joy nook it's easy and fun to make let's begin in my kitchen I'm using 400 grams of glutinous rice flour add two cups and one tablespoon of water Knead the flour for 10 minutes. To make it more fun, I like to add food coloring to my dough. Knead it well until the color all blend in. To make the filling, I'm using half a cup of moon bean. I wash it with cold water for a few times. Put in a pot with two cups of water. Bring it to a boil. Put the heat to low, cook for half an hour, and your moon wind turn out like this. After half an hour, shut off the heat. Use a strainer to strain out the liquid. Put the moon wind in a bowl. Add one tablespoon of sugar and a pinch of salt. Use the spoon to mash it up. I'm using about one tablespoon of moon wind and roll it up in a ball. To make the syrup, I'm using brown candy. In this package, it has six pieces. To my taste, I'm using 11 pieces of this brown candy with two liters of water on medium heat. Add about three tablespoons of ginger slices to the syrup. I like to cook my glutinous rice balls in the syrup because it tastes a lot better that way. Put the heat on between medium and low before you cook the rice balls. To make the ball, I'm using about three tablespoons of the dough. Put it in your hands and roll it up like a ball. Flatten it like this. Put the filling in the middle. Close it up. And keep rolling until it turns out like a ball. After you get the shape you like, put in the syrup to cook it and continue to do until you finish. For the leftover dough, I like to make the pearls. Now your glutinous rice balls and ginger syrup is done. You can shut off the heat. I love how beautiful it looks. To make the coconut cream, I'm using 8.5 ounces of coconut milk. Add 2 tablespoons of sugar and a pinch of salt. Put on low heat and stir it well. To thicken the coconut milk, I'm using 2 teaspoons of tapioca flour with 1 tablespoon of water. Mix it well, pour it in, stir it, and then shut off the heat. It's time to serve. Put the closeness rice balls in a bowl. Put some coconut cream on top. Lastly, sprinkle some roasted sesame seeds. Now enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you again. Bye bye.